Coming up next, Lynn White with the weather. Stay with us. We'll be right back. Well, it may be close to April, but it sure felt like December today. Lynn White is here to tell us if the cold weather will continue tomorrow. Lynn? Yes, it will, Nancy. And today was indeed nice, sunny, and bright, but it felt more like winter than it did like spring. Our high temperature only 38 degrees below 29, and that's where the thermometer stands right now, 29 degrees Fahrenheit, minus 2 degrees Celsius. The relative humidity, again, that number 29%. Those winds blowing in from the northwest, at 28 miles per hour and the barometer 30.23 inches and it's on the rise the skies outside clear looking at high pressure that was responsible for the colder temperatures today along with northwesterly winds now as this high moves southeastwardly we'll see a return flow of air coming around the back side of it that means our winds will come in from the south and our temperature should be up about 60 degrees by tuesday taking a look at the satellite photo we have clouds to the east of us clouds to the west of us Clear skies will prevail until tomorrow, when sunny skies will turn partly cloudy. And I'll be back in just 30 seconds with a complete look at the forecast for the next few days. So you stay with us. In the forecast for tonight, we have clear skies. It will be windy and cool. Lows in the mid-20s in the city, the teens in the suburbs, and they're calling this spring. Tomorrow, partly to mostly sunny, cold again, diminishing winds. Still, the temperatures will be on the low side in low to mid 40s. Sunday night, clear and cold, the lows in the low to mid 30s. And on Monday, sunny and mild, a little more springy, 50 to 55 degrees. Tuesday, a beautiful spring-like day with the temperatures 55 to 60 degrees. Nancy?